Okay, and seriously, there's no stopping him. Hey everybody, it's Flower, and I am back for my fourth section hike on the Appalachian Trail. So those of you that have watched me before, you guys know that I have already done um, all of West Virginia, Maryland, and Pennsylvania. And this time I decided to tackle Virginia. So I started today, it is Saturday, June 18th, and I started in Damascus, Virginia. So technically the border of Tennessee and Virginia is a few miles before Damascus, but there's no um, parking or access to the trail where I could have got dropped off there. So started in Damascus and it's actually a cute little town. It's considered kind of the gateway to Virginia. So this time I'm out here for eight days, which is the longest trip that I've done so far. And we're just going to see how far I can get. Um, it is really, really hot out here already. So I'm kind of excited to get to some higher elevation. There are still some rhododendrons blooming. And we have newts again. Anybody know what kind of fungus this is? If you do, please leave it in the comments. Okay, well, I just made it up Straight Mountain, and that was a bit of a climb in the heat. Um, luckily, it wasn't straight up. There were switchbacks, but it's still kind of steep. And you know what? There's not even a view at the top, so it's a little bit of a bummer. But I have another couple miles to go um, to my campsite tonight. Ha! Huh. That's the second time in my life that I've found a smiley face. This is like the 50th pile of bear poo that I've spotted on the trail today. It's absolutely everywhere. You guys, this trail is so nice. I'm not going to say that there haven't been any rocks or roots today, because there have been. But, oh man, this is awesome. This is nothing like Pennsylvania. I'm loving it. Look at this gorgeous little pond. I am going to set up my tent right over here. Good morning everybody. It's day two and I actually slept really well last night at that little pond. I usually don't sleep that well the first night back on trail but I did this time. I'm just listening to the frogs all night so that was pretty cool. And today, I'm kind of excited about today. It's going to be uphill most of the day which is going to be rough but I get up to the highlands area and I know there are wild ponies that live up there so Fingers crossed that either today or tomorrow I get to see some wild ponies. That would be really awesome. Okay, so the trail just met up with the Virginia Creeper Trail, which used to be a railroad, and they just turned it into a nice path for biking and walking. And I saw a lot of people on bikes yesterday. Looks like a really, really nice path. It goes along this river. So I just fell down for the first time. Made it all the way through the Pennsylvania rocks and didn't fall. And then I just fell right here on a random loose stone. How stupid. But luckily, 
and they have a little scrape. Not a big deal. So this is the Lost Mountain Shelter, which is a nice little shelter, and it has actually a lot of tenting spots too, and a privy. So I'm just going to sit and have a little snack here, though. All right, that's the mountain we're about to climb. Holy cow, guys, that was one heck of a climb, but look at these views. That is so beautiful. I haven't seen anything like this yet. Guess what? Passing my personal 300 mile mark. I'm really loving how different the forest looks up here at this elevation. I see ponies! Oh my gosh, that made sweating up and down those hills all day long. Totally worth it. Yep, getting a pony bath. Apparently I'm salty. I'm not really getting that clean. He's just wiping grass all over. <laughs> now that is a good campsite.